eaten cooked food. Next one, right? Food that were uh, once completely cooked and were then allowed to cool may be heated in a certain instance, in certain instances. This will be discussed later in page 22. So we're going to get it in this chapter. Okay, summary. The Torah prohibition of Bishul, Bishul is, Bishul is cooking, uh, forbids cooking solid foods to the level of uh, foods of uh, Ben uh, Drusad. There's a minimal degree of edibility, one third cook. Okay, so as we said, so we're going to go, even though there's a different opinion, so we, we can rely only in case of meat. So, but now we have to remember one third. And the liquids uh, to the point Yatsala Desbo. So Yatsala Desbo is cooking. Below that, it's not cooking. In practice, however, it is rabbinically forbidden to place any uncooked item, even for a moment, near the source of the heat capable of cooking that item uh, to these levels. Okay, so basically we're talking about uh, solid foods or liquids, doesn't matter. If you put uh, in a glass of water or something uh, next to uh, the source of heat, it can get uh, very hot. Okay. Uh, or on, on a black, for example, black is covered and you have uh, um, have four four spots for four grids. So you put a on a, like and you put a, a, what is it a fire only on, 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 under one. So even if you go like a, a, the, the the furthest away corner, it's still very hot. So you're not allowed to, to put water there. Okay. Mm -hmm.